So I think I think one of the things that really helped me was I was able to commit a good amount of time to it. And I think that that's just, you know, up front that what we talked about with time, it, you're going to mm -hmm. have to put in the hours. And, you know, depending on how you schedule that, if, you know, if, if, if me and you were, were learning a new skill and you put in an hour a day and I put in two hours a day, at the end of a month, I have twice the amount of experience you mm -hmm. know, than you in that. So I, you can accelerate quickly by adding more time. But I would say the other thing that super helped me is because I will put in all the time, but I could put it in the wrong direction, right? I can get distracted easily. And so that's where I think um, Evolve or Bootcamp, you know, is structured to keep you kind of learning all the facets of cybersecurity that you need to know, the basics, the fundamentals, even the not so fun stuff that you really need to dive into and understand at a good level. Um, that's where, you know, that focus really helped. And it, it got me around, um, you know, real cybersecurity professionals. So there's a, a difference, you know, there's a little bit of a gap too between, uh, you know, knowing something, but then knowing what that looks like in a productive environment, right? Um, and there's a, there's a few little gaps there. So, you know, you know a little bit, but you haven't used it in, 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 a, in, a, in a full production environment where things are, things are the same, but a little different. So you have, to, you have to kind of figure that out. You know, to wrap this up, we have a few more minutes here. Do you have any final advice for your any final words of wisdom that you want to leave um, leave our audience with about either cyber working in the cybersecurity industry currently or your transition the job search anything just that you know cybersecurity is is a great field we need tons of more professionals you know there's a huge gap and uh, it's part of the reason why you know my company does such a good job is we help manage uh, you know, shortfalls within uh, businesses that don't have the staff to, to do the things right now. So it's always going to be growing right now. And the only thing that's stopping you is, is jumping in and learning. It's right there for you. You don't have to wait. It's not like a medical degree where you need facilities and patients to practice on. Like your tech is here. If you have a laptop, like you can learn anything you want. It's at your fingertips. That's right. Um, one more question that we just had come in really quickly. Um, any tips on what to put on your LinkedIn profile when you're going through the learning phase? You know, we have a lot of people in the boot camp who are practicing and, and people not even in the boot camp. What do you recommend they, you know, the skills that they put on their LinkedIn? I mean, anything that you work on, any labs that you're going on, uh, you know, just get like an overall, you know, general topic for that and throw it on there as a skill. You know, I'm learning Linux. I'm learning, uh, you know, networking, you know, whatever skills like that are good to put on there. And then the other thing I did that really helped with uh, LinkedIn was reach out to uh, people in the field that, uh, you know, have the job title that you're going after. And I reached out to a ton of people networking wise, like I didn't um, know anybody at my company that helped get me in. But what really helped me was talking to some people, um, professionals that already did the job and learning like this, what their day to day was and and they're always, I love everybody in this field. They're always so helpful and willing of, to give their time like that. And they'll give back and, uh, and I'll do the same as well. Um, if anybody wants to hit me up on LinkedIn, but, uh, so that was really beneficial. And that gave me an idea. I talked to some people in the field, in the, you know, doing the, the skills that I would need to be doing. So it gave me a, 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 a lot of confidence going into interviews that I knew what the, the role was and what it, what it, you know, 